Yeah, hey there, Glenn and Lou. Some new numbers came out for 2020 about the number of dog bites on postal workers in 2020. And they were up a bit from 2019, and the Postal Service and postal workers want people to take note. Nationally, there were nearly, let's see, there were more than 5,800 dog bites nationally. Statewide here in California, there were nearly 800. As you talked about in Garden Grove, this was considered an area with a high number of dog bites given its size here. Here in Garden Grove, there were eight dog bites. A lot of these dog bites around the country caused serious injuries. So postal workers want people to know when your postman, your mailman or mailwoman is in the area, make sure your dog is under control so things like this don't happen as often. We, we have pets too. We love our pets too and they are part of the family just like everything else. And we're just asking you to be responsible. That's all we're asking because in doing so it keeps our employees safe and it allows our employees to go home unharmed. Now, another piece of motivation for you, and including keeping the postal workers safe, is you don't want to disrupt your own postal service. They say if a dog bite happens, your dog bites a postal worker. Service to your address will be suspended, and not only that, it's possible service to your entire neighborhood could be suspended while they investigate and try to figure out what needs to be done to make it safe for the postal worker to go back into that neighborhood. For now, reporting live in Garden Grove, I'm Chip Yost, KTLA 5 News.